<laughs> I wasn't expecting that. So we're going to finish up with dessert. What is it? What is this? Yeah. What's, What's special puto bong bong? So what is it in English? What's puto? Uh, puto, uh, bamboo rice. Nice, bamboo rice. Oh, bamboo rice. Inside. Okay, cool. Yeah, right. Bamboo rice. And so what happens? The rice, the rice goes in there. And then what? Butter. Oh my god, butter again. Okay. So it's ube and then you put the rice in? Yeah. Okay. Ube is like a taro. It's a purple taro. It's like a root. Yes. Kind of a root crop thing. Actually, ube is a purple yam and it's a massive favourite here in the Philippines. There's ube ice cream, ube shakes and ube cakes. It wouldn't surprise me if there's even ube lechon kawali. It's that popular. This particular puto bumbong turns out to be a special one, available just for Christmas. So I'm keen to find out what all the hype's about. We had to drag him off the basketball court. The basketball court's there. So we had to call him over and here he is now. Yeah. <laughs> so not a bad lifestyle, hey? Business and pleasure. Look at this, here we go. I still don't know what's happening here. I don't know what... It's heating up. And does it go into there? Here we go. Okay, steaming up. Steam's coming out. Got something happening here. Tip it in. Okay. Who came up with this idea? Who came up? Who came up with this contraption? Coconut. I wasn't expecting that. Okay, it looks tasty though. Yeah, in the coconut as well. Oh, no more butter. No more butter. No, no, it's okay. It's okay. Yeah. There's a lot of butter on it already. Okay, what's this? Is it um, cheese? I gotta psych myself up for this one. Not really sure where the where the cheese part comes into this. So rice, steamed rice with ube and coconut, very tropical. Oh my god. And I, I held back on the butter as well. <laughs> How do I eat this without dying? Alright, okay. Alright, thank you. Alright. So, let's give this a go. I just don't know where the cheese comes in. Maybe it's buffalo cheese, do you think? Or just processed? Because you've got all these tropical flavours and then you put this cheese on it. It's odd. Anyway, here we go. I'll just... Yeah, let's try. Hmm. Not as sweet as I thought it was going to be. Um, obviously the condensed milk, I can taste that. But it's quite light. Full of calories. Full of calories, but it's quite nice. Quite mild. Delicious. Very delicious. delicious. Bamboo rice. Yeah, your, your time is full, right? Okay, that's it for Ugbo Street in Tondo. It's intense. We got here at about 5 o'clock, 5.30 on a Monday. Uh, it's not even Christmas yet. We've got about another nearly 10 days to go till Christmas. 
and now it's about seven. I think we spent a couple of hours here and it's pumping. So if you're gonna come here, make sure you get here early. Uh, unless you enjoy the crowds and the, the traffic and all that sort of stuff, maybe come about seven o'clock. Cause actually there's a whole lot more stalls out uh, compared to when we came. Um, would I come back? Uh, probably I'd come back later in the evening. I noticed that there's a few bars and things opening up as well, so it might be worth checking out. I'm pretty happy to be going home though. I've had plenty to eat, um, had a couple of drinks, which is great, and great experience all around. So uh, I'll leave directions in the description so you can find it if you're interested. It's a bit of a trek. It's right out near the port somewhere, and now we've got another probably two hours to go. <laughs> Um, to get back home to Las Piñas on the other side of town, so wish me luck. Yeah,